hello everyone welcome to my channel easy tutorials and today in this video you will learn how to make a flight booking form that you can use in travel website as you can see on my computer screen it is very beautiful and transparent flight booking form with text input date select option number input one drop down select option and one search button before starting this video, I will request you to please subscribe my channel AG Tutorials to watch more videos like this one. Now let's start to create this flight booking form. This is my HTML file and I have already linked my HTML to the CSS file. Now I will copy this line of code here and here we will add bootstrap file. For that I will remove this one and now I will go to the Google. and search for bootstrap cdn open this first url and from this website just copy this link and paste it here ok after adding this bootstrap link just go to the body section and here we have to create one div and the class name will be booking form box now let's go to the css file and here we will add background image After that, I'll write background position, center and background size cover. Now I'll copy this class name and paste it here in the CSS file. And for this one, I'll set maximum width is equal to 350 pixel and border. Then margin. Now open this website. From google chrome here you can't see this box because there is no content inside so let's create one more div in this box and the class name will be radio dash btn and in this div there will be three radio buttons The first one will be round trip, the second one way and the third one will be multi city. For the first checkbox here I will write checked is equal to checked. Now you can see the first checkbox is selected. Now just copy this class name in the CSS file and here we will write margin and after that we will write code for this button. Margin box shadow and now I will write code here after content will be blank and height 15 pixel width 15 pixel top minus 2 pixel left minus 1 the background color will be white position relative display inline block and some border also border radius I'll make it 50% so you can see this round button here now I'll copy this one here and here I'll write checked after the content will be blank and background color will be black now save these changes Now I'll write code for this span, color will be white, 
margin right will be 5 pixel and the font size now here we will create one more div and the class name will be booking form and in this form we will create all the fields all the input fields first i'll write label and after that one input field the type will be text and here we'll write one class also form control that is bootstrap class the placeholder city or airport simply i'll copy and paste it to create the another input field Now we will create a small input field that is date select option. The type will be date and here we will write one more class select date. I will select the date input two times. And after that, I'll create one more field that is number. The value will be one. And again, one more number field. And for this one, value will be zero. Now I'll create one drop down select option. Here we can select travel class so for that i'll write one class name here custom select and here will be two option option value one and option value two business class now refresh this website and you can see this all the input field here and all this form are in full width after that i'll create one more group and here we'll create one submit button and i'll write one more class name flight the text will be so flights Now I'll copy this booking form class name in the CSS file. Padding will be 0, 20 pixel, 20 pixel and now I'll write code for this label. For this one margin bottom will be 5 pixel, margin top and font size. And color now for this input field I'll write placeholder and we'll change the placeholder color also now refresh this page and you can see the changes on this page now I'll copy this input GRP the width will be 151 pixel display inline block now you can see this date is aligned in the single line now I'll copy this class name form control and for this one I'll write font size border radius color background will be transparent box add on none and here I'll put important because it is a bootstrap class 
now you can see this input field is transparent now I'll copy this class name select date and we'll write this webkit inner spin button and this one will be outer spin button and then appearance is equal to none margin zero so now you can see there is no spin button here on this page now again I'll copy it and I'll write calendar picker indicator and for this one background will be transparent now you can see this indicator background is transparent now I'll copy this class name custom select and for this one I'll write color white and font size border box shadow none border radius 0 and background transparent here also we'll put important now refresh this page and you can see this select option is transparent now I'll copy this one here and after that I'll write option and write color now I'll copy this class name flight to design this button for this one I'll write width adding font size border background transparent box shadow and box radius here also we'll put important Now we'll add hover effect on this button. When we will hover it, the background color will become white and text color will be black. We have learned how to make this flight booking form. If this video is helpful for you, please like and share this video and also comment on this video and do not forget to